friends so continuing to the video series of uh, parallel algorithm now we will see sequential model so sequential model can be described by only the single diagram as you are seeing over here so sequential model or the random access machine is a model of one address computer so the one address computer consists of input tape uh, which contains the sequence of integers okay and every time the input is read by the input head this is the input head every time uh, the input head reads the input tape uh, the input uh, head advances by one square that is moves to the next square and uh, same with the output tape every time the output is written to the output tape the output head this is the output head it advances by one square okay and the memory this is the memory it consists of an unbounded sequence of register that is r0 r1 r2 r3 this, these all denotes the registers and uh, all the computations are performed over here only and the combination of all this is known as accumulator uh, okay so every time uh, execution starts only with the first instruction and proceeds forward with the program order fine so yeah, we have two ways of measuring time and space complexity on RAM model. What are they? They are a uniform cost criteria and logarithmic cost criteria. Uh, so the uniform cost criteria says that each RAM instruction requires one unit space only. Okay, each RAM. Uh, each RAM instruction consists of uh, one unit space only, okay? And the logarithmic cost criteria takes into account that an actual world of memory has a limited capacity, okay? So, because of these two criteria, the uh, space and time complexity of the RAM model are measured. Uh, so the various computation required by the parallel computations are not fulfilled by the sequential model uh, so uh, the parallel computation model came into action uh, so we will uh, look uh, forward to it in the uh, next lectures hope you like the video subscribe to my channel for more such updates